glad to have you with us once again this one. Now, if you saw the last episode, you know what I have been done to have went through. I have been tortured not once, but twice. For picking up the million dollar win and then losing it a few spins later to a bankrupt. Just because I didn't know the puzzle at the time. And I had to solve it. But hopefully, today is that day. Today is that opportunity. And today is hopefully the day we can capture that million dollar win, keep it, take it to the bonus round, and play for one million bucks. And I want to do it today. So, I'm feeling good, feeling lucky. Today is finally going to be that day we break through. So, let's get right to it. I'm actually recording this one in the, um, at one of the other chat rooms that I'm a part of here and the recording room. So, you may hear the voices of some friends of mine pop in and out to the video. But we're ready to get to it. So, let's play some Wheel of Fortune, shall we? Alright. We're up today. And we're back with, hey, Chris was on our last episode. He's back with us. And we're playing with Wendy as well. Let's go. $1,000 toss up to start off. It's rhyme time, is the category. Let's look it. All right. Maybe have a chance at this. Uh, got it. Uh, switch that for y'all. It's good, night, sleep, tight. It is. All right, first thousand dollars is mine. I'll take it. All right, two thousand dollar toss at this time. Category is fun and games. Well, we all like to play some fun and games. And punch it. Let's see. Uh, got it. Doing the limbo, which is something I'm horrible at. All right, first two tosses are mine. Got an easy early three thousand dollar lead. We're gonna see if we can hold on to it as we continue down this road to time. And it's time for more ride time. So let's put it up on the board for round one. It's our jackpot round. More rhyme time action, and I'm going to spin that wheel. Let's go. All right, I have. Ah, uh, okay. At least if at least you're gonna bankrupt me, bankrupt me on the first spin, where I'm not nearly as mad about it. But oh my goodness, and I got the million and then get bankrupt. I'm like, ah, uh, uh, heartbreak. So I'm like, I'm not as mad about that. But we'll get a shot to get it back here. Chris gets the free play and picks E. And put two E's on the board. And spin time. Let's go. And he gets hit by the million dollar bankrupt as well. Ugh. That thing is being very protective of it. I think it's because I've hit it the last two episodes. That's another reason why it to stay away, but we'll see here. Wow, and Wendy gets bankrupt. The lag spaces are out for blood today, folks. <laughs> Those bankrupts want to take everybody. All right, my first cash spin of the day, 700. Let's have a T, please. No T's. Very well. Chris, back to you. Chris going to spin again. And it's going to be 300 for him. He says N. I say there is an N. He wants to buy a vowel. A. I uh, can't do an A. Sorry, Chris. And Wendy, back to you. Hopefully she doesn't get hit by a bankrupt this time. So... They have a wild card opportunity for her. Let's see if she gets it. She says H. No H. Wild card stays at the wheel. And back to me. Let's go. Come on, 2,500. 
All right, five hundred dollars. Is there an R? No R's. Wow, what kind of rhyme time is this? All right, jackpots up to seventy-five hundred. Spins the wheel. A tough, tough crowd on this one for sure. It says D. There is no D for you, sir. Wendy, back to you. Gonna spin. Another chance for that wild card for her. She wants the S. Yep, there's two S's. There you go. She is on the board. She's got the wild card. She's got herself a thousand dollars, I believe. She does. So what's she gonna do? She's gonna buy the I. And there's no I. So you lose your turn, but you keep the wild card for now. Back to me. Which I have not had much luck with this puzzle yet, but I'm a breakthrough. Hey, look, so I'm guaranteed another turn. Um, I'm thinking, um, L. There it is, one L. Put the money in the bank, and I know the puzzle now. Now, let's see if we can get that million. That would actually be nice. I'd take that. 300. Um, I guess I'm going to have to. Why? Too high. And I'll spin. If I have the $2,500 now, I'm going to be angry. Nope, 300. Z. That's it. Nothing but vowels left. We're going to solve this one. You snooze, you lose. It is. So 4400 bucks in the bank. Got the early lead here. And this we continue on to our second round, our mystery round. We have the $10,000 out there. As we look at this puzzle, category is place this time. And Chris is going to get us going. There's 500 for you, Chris. It says an S. Sorry, there's no S's, sir. Back to Wendy. Gonna spin. She gonna spin to win. So she gonna win herself a free play. And free play says T. I say there's one T. Gonna buy a vowel. This is A. Two A's. Puts it down to 250. She's still got possession of the wild card, so that could come into play a little bit more. 500 for this time around. H. Uh, no H's. Over to me. Let's spin that wheel. Come on, baby! Give it to me! Give it to me! Yes! Alright. Focus. Don't mess up now. R. Ah! Shot through the heart, and you're to blame. Why can't there be our Ow. Well, maybe Chris picked up the million. N should have picked should have went with my letter. Well dang it. Well, Chris has got the million all the way, so at least I don't have to worry about losing it to a bankrupt this time around. He does, however. He gets to be put in that pressure cooker. And look at that! Oh. Fell to the same fate I did. Okay, you know what? For what's better you than me, Chris, because I didn't want no part of that. I've been heartbroken twice, two games in a row. I did not feel like making it three. Because I am not about that life. All right. 
But you gotta figure out what the heck this place is. Thirty-five hundred. Nice. Okay. Chance for money. Did not mess it up. Um. L. An L. All right. Oh, got it. Got it. Now it. It just hit me. Get out of there. Get out. No, you son of a monkey! Uh. <laughs> I laugh only out of frustration, ladies and gentlemen. Can't tell you how many times in my life when I just figured it out and I go for just a little bit more money that it just comes in and it's like, nope, no more money for you. You fail. <laughs> oh well, thus is thus is the game of Wheel of Fortune. I can't do a whole lot of that. No, oh, oh, so hey, at least I get a second chance. You know what? We're gonna go for the complete fail right here. We're hoping, let's see if we can hit a mystery wave. We'll flip it over. I don't care if I get bankrupt on that one, because I'm like, it's not really gonna hurt me a whole lot. I'll take the cane though. And... Nope, I'm not going to even make house minimum here. So let's do V. And you know what? Because I'm going to get bumped up to a thousand anyway. I'm just going to buy the vowel. You. And solve with bank vault. Wait, how... <sighs> I just solved it. What the heck? Oh, I did it wrong. I messed up. I didn't just. I went and hit um, give up instead of solve by mistake out of habit. So that's why I failed at that one. So that is my own fault. Yeah, hey, failed the comment for failing on a completely solved puzzle. I know how they feel now on Wheel of Fortune after show. Oh, anyhow, I've still got a lead. Chris picked up $1,000 for picking up off of my mistake. But I've still got a lead as we go to our third round puzzle. We still got $3,500 at the wheel. Fun and games is the category, and Wendy's in the process of already filling in half the letters. Most of them are all vowels, but she's working it very well. Is the I? All right, she's got the A E I O, and why didn't she buy the U? I'm like, you went that far. You might as well bought them all at that point. Oh. Damn, loss of turn. Sorry. So I guess that I guess that U's gonna come to me. Let's go. Try this again. Four fifty. Can I have a? R. On R. And I'll spin. Five hundred. Um. H. I actually know the puzzle, so we're not gonna mess this one up. This time. Trying to get that big money over here. 500 again. How about the F of a? Yep, one F. 1450 now. As I spin the wheel. And say 500. Um, let, random letter I don't ever pick. X. All right, come on. I'm holding it out for the big money. And I keep spinning green 500. But you know what? Hey, I'll take it $500 at a time. I'm not that picky. Right now, I said, I've still got a lead. I've got that, like, pad now. Get off the bankrupt. No! You... Ugh. 
<laughs> oh my goodness. This game, I swear. 400, Chris. And, yep, that was the letter I was saving for the 3,500. So now all he has to do is pretty much just spin out. There's, hey look, another green 500. How convenient. There's a C. Chris has just capitalized off all my mistakes. That's the only reason he has money right now. And had that been the million dollar wedge still been in play, he would have just got bankrupt there. But instead, he gets $800 for a G, and he solves the puzzle with Dancing the Foxtrot. And just like that, he's only $1,300 behind me. But again, very important now we get this toss up. We're going to try to beat him out for it. $3,000 toss up on the line. Category this time around is terrible. We gotta get this one quickly. Alright, um... And dang it, Wendy beats me to the buzzer. Mythological creature is right, and she's on the board. She's only $100 behind Chris. It's pretty much anybody's game right now, so... It's going to come down to this final puzzle. Category is proper name. And round four, Wendy's going to start. And she still has the wild card. So she can be used that to her advantage here. We'll see what happens. Wendy, get us going. As we look at the shiny, shiny $5,000 space on the wheel. And 900. She says T. One T. Now, we're pretty much playing against the clock at this point, dude. So, we'll see what happens. Over to me, my turn. All right. So, I'm going to, I'm going to get at least one spin. So, that'll give me a chance. Straight this down. Basically, I got to win this puzzle somehow. to have a chance here. Let's go. Um, N. Two N's. I'll spin again. Let's go. We're going to spend 800. Uh, for 800, how about an R? Two R's. Uh, by Val. I? Yep, there's an I. Buy another Val. E? Two E's. Buy another Val. A? A. Now let me have the O as well. Two O's. All right, uh, no vowels left. Um, I wish I knew it. I'm gonna have to spin. <sighs> the stress levels are over 9,000 right now. I kill you not. Oh, V. You know what? I'll take it. I'm solving. Verizon Smartphone. There we go. Cut my losses and pad my lead so I can bank that. So normally that's it. And that's it. The four rounds is in the game. I solved it before we even got to the final spin. I think that's the first time we've done that this series. But hey, I ain't mad at it. So, Alright, let's go. Enough, I got the win. Now we're going for a hundred thousand dollars. All right, double stars. All right, person is the category. We go with the R, the S, the T, the L, the N, and the E. Huh. Gonna need three more consonants and a vowel here. Well, I know there's an I in there, so the I is probably going to be my vowel. But let's go... M? C? 
see. P and I. No help at all. Okay, didn't get 35,000, but hey, it's still a win. It's 7,300. Not really my greatest showing, but a win nonetheless. Plus, we have to 1,383,000 plus. And now we are just two more episodes away from wrapping it all up. Two more chances to get that million dollar win. Can we get it by the end of the series? I don't know. Channel yet, you want to see more of the great games I have here at MVP Production? Don't hesitate to hit that subscribe button down below and ring the bell that way you never miss all the great party games we have right here at MVP Production. And until the wheel comes spinning your way once again, we have more focus to solve and a couple more chances to win that million dollar win. I'm your host, Brandon Scruggs, saying thanks for watching. See you next time for another edition of the Fortune Channel. Take care. I'm for that one.